Garibe back in court this morning. His trial going on for the 2016 murder of his wife, Rosa Garibe. Day four of the trial showing the intense questioning Garibe went under after his wife was reported missing. The interrogation taking place over several hours. And once again, the video, we were not allowed in court today. Our cameras were not anyways. Uh, a video of Gonzalo Garibe's interrogation, though, played in court for our crews there today. It showed Garibe caving to investigators nearly 10 hours later after after their investigation, agreeing to show police where his wife's body was allegedly located around 2.30 in the morning. Throughout that video played in court today, Gonzalo denying knowing where his wife was and knowing what happened to her. Questioning, though, became intense around the 11 p.m. hour. That was seven hours into questioning. Investigators telling Gonzalo Rosa deserves better and that his children deserve to have a proper burial for his wife. While that part of the video played, Rosa's sisters in court today sobbing and Rosa's older sister put her arm around her younger sister there. Meanwhile, Gonzalo Garibay's reaction to the video has been the same throughout the court. Over the 10 hour period, he has sat right in front of the screen, according to our crews inside the courtroom with his glasses on, following along with the transcript calmly. Just after 2 a.m., a new investigator told Gonzalo Garibay they think Rosa is dead and they saw a lot of blood in the trunk of his car. However, they did not know how she died and they still needed Garibay to tell them what happened. That video ended at 2 o'clock in the morning with Garibay and two investigators going for a drive. Her body would be found later in that remote location near Ojai. And where the video ended is where today's hearing ended as well. Prosecution planning to continue with investigators testimony when court is scheduled to resume tomorrow.